Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for 5th? Yeah, right around the 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th. You know the timing is fluid everywhere. We're all at different journeys. We're, we're all at different times on our journey, right? Same thing. Anyhow, what do we got for a message? What kind of message do we have? Uh, we have somebody who needs to move on from a bad choice by the looks of things. You may be subject to trial, may be put under trial, may be asked a lot of questions. Somebody may be asking some questions, feeling like you're being questioned. You may be questioned. Questions for your actions. Hmm, be prepared to be questioned by the looks of things. What do we got? Woo! Well, the King of Swords. That's somebody that is very inquisitive. Ooh, okay. So that fell out. There's going to be a fallout. There is going to be a fallout of some sort. This person is very intelligent. He knows something, okay? This guy, he is, uh, looks like he's got on some armor, so he's a warrior of some sort. It looks like he has to make some sort of tough call. Hard, uh, tough call. He's making a tough call, a tough decision. Um, he knows he has to. He has to say something. He hasn't. He's been keeping it to himself. He's about to speak up. Could be dealing with an air sign, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Doesn't have to be. We all take on these energies. This looks like this. Uh, it's time to get to the bottom of this. We're going to get to the bottom of this. I got some questions. So this could be somebody in the law that is going to be asking some questions or somebody in a position of authority. Now, the, the tower reversed is um, extremes. There could be a fight. There could be a permanent loss. You never saw it coming. So I'm wondering if the law is going to get involved in a situation. Maybe, maybe not. But we have somebody here that knows that they've been watching. They've... Uh, they got to do this. They're making a decision um, based on the facts. Um, it's not about feelings. It's about uh, getting down to the bottom of this, whatever it is. This guy's watching and he's observing or he has been watching. He knows. Now, this is false. Okay, this is something is false. It's not true. It's it's unreal. He knows that something isn't real. There's going to be a breakdown or something like that. There could be a catastrophe even. There's a disaster. Something is a disaster waiting to happen. I feel as though something is about to get turned right right around or upside down. Um we have this is extremely unhealthy or extremely unstable. There's something that isn't right. There is something that isn't right. Could have to do with. I mean, this could be this. This could be a home, and this could be somebody, you know, coming to put the. I don't know what it is, but um, getting thrown out. Somebody may be getting thrown out. Let's get some more cards. What is this tower reversed? You never saw this coming, whatever it is. Ooh, high, you didn't. You didn't. The high priestess. You never. It's funny that I said that. This is lack of awareness. So we have somebody here that never saw it coming. This could be an investigator. Could have been a private investigator. Could be somebody... I think it is somebody in security, somebody in law enforcement. I really feel like it is somebody in law enforcement that is making some sort of call. And you're, somebody is totally not aware. They are not aware, completely, you completely unaware of what is about to happen. No awareness whatsoever. Somebody has been living under false pretenses. Pretending, pretending that everything was good. Hmm. Ooh, yikes. Now, this one's going over here. 
yeah that guy has been keeping to himself hasn't been communicating has kind of like been in the background so we have somebody here that has been in the background watching and observing now this is the death of an idea or person this is a dead end something is happening something is about to happen it's going to be very shocking it is definitely going to be a shock Somebody, something about independence. Somebody may be, because this could be a breakup, the tower reversed. Somebody could be becoming independent. Um, could be the end of independence as well. Could be the end of a painful situation. Hmm. This guy hasn't been communicating. He hasn't. He hasn't. The sword is down and this is no, he's been keeping to himself. He's been observing and he's come to some sort of conclusion. He, he has, I know that he has. There's some sort of false pretenses here. This independent person is completely unaware. This is somebody who's been focusing on themselves, focusing on their life, very self-sufficient, focused on their business, uh, just enjoying the finer things in life. Uh, now, this could be in a state of recuperation. This person has been recuperating from a false foundation. They have been recuperating from a disaster or a catastrophe of some sort. They've been recuperating from that. They have. They have. Somebody has gone through some period of healing. They've gone through a timeout. They've already, I feel like this person has already had a timeout. For some of you, you're about to go into hermit mode, okay? You're about to go into timeout mode. But for some of you, you've already been there, okay? Um, somebody here is also being thrown out of a false foundation, like a home. You know, they're, they're, seriously. You don't need, it's like, it just happens suddenly. You could be getting thrown out. What I was going to say earlier, and I stopped, it was like putting, changing the locks. Somebody may be changing the locks, I hate to say that, but that's what I was going to say. Now, this is a very enlightened individual. We have an enlightened individual or somebody that is going to become enlightened through a timeout, through in, through a uh, time of reflection. So we, we do have a time of reflection here where somebody grows. They go through a period of growth. They go through a period of enlightenment because they have not been enlightened. So we have somebody here that's not awakened, but they're going to go through an awakening. They are. Interesting. Ooh. Eight of Cups reversed. Now, this is, like I said, this is false pretenses. This is pretending. This is pretending to be happy, superficial, and shallow. Refusing to move on or staying put in a situation. Somebody has been staying put in a false sense of security a false foundation where there was a lack of happiness but they were pretending to be happy now there's been some emotional weakness here but this is strength so somebody is going to be finding their strength to persevere on their own or they have now this could be somebody wanting to come back okay wanting to come back somebody may be wanting to come back or wanting to uh, go towards this person Justice. Justice is a decision. It is a decision. It is karma. It is fair and just decision. So there's a decision that is being made. A choice. The truth. Some sort of final decision. This is karma. Some sort of karma. It's time to withdraw. Somebody is going to be, be withdrawing. Or they did withdraw with the Nine of Pentacles. This is withdrawal. It's But this is the end. But this is hmm, making a decision based on the facts, again. Based on the truth. We have somebody here that has no toleration for lies. There's some sort of karma that is coming around. I think that we have somebody that is... It feels like they're they're going to... Uh, this is a huge loss. The tower reversed. It is. And it's a permanent loss. I feel like we have somebody here that is going to be experiencing some sort of karma. It, 
and it has to do with being alone okay because this is being alone and this is being alone and this is being alone so being alone something to do with being alone but getting what you deserve so somebody's about to get what they deserve Hmm. Woo! We get the two of wands reversed. And, I mean, upright. And the two of swords reversed. We have two twos. So we have a partnership that is not on the same page. Okay? We do. We have a relationship, a partnership, or whatever it is, a contract, whatever, that is not on the same page. And I feel like there's going to be a major uproar. Okay? With that, with that tower reversed, I think there's, there could be a fight. Okay? Put it that way. It could be a fight where somebody decides to retreat and go their own way, okay? And somebody is left alone. It's like now you're going to be alone, okay? So I feel like uh, there is a decision that is about to be made, and I think it comes about very suddenly. It does come about very suddenly. Um, I do something to do with law as well. So, and it could be just the laws of karma, or it could be you know this. The laws of justice, okay? So I feel like there is some sort of, uh, this is against the law. Now you're going to get what you deserve. However that resonates with you. Somebody has been pretending and they have been living under false pretenses. And it feels like their fakeness is going to come to light. Okay, something is going to be shown. Something is going to be shown There's gonna, it feels as, as though we have somebody, again, pretending. They have been pretending, but Lisa's lies being exposed. So there is going to be something that is going to happen. Some sort of truth is going to come out. Something is going to happen. It is. Something is going to happen. We have somebody here that, I think we have, this is like, I feel like this is communication uh, over over the internet, okay? There's been some sort of social media um communication that gets revealed because somebody maybe they've been talking to somebody else or whatever and somehow it gets shown it gets revealed or something like that um there's definitely a choice there's a decision because of these twos and this right here and this there's somebody here that is making a decision based on the facts based on the truth they now now they see something okay now they see something clearly i feel like the where they may have been confused in the past they're not confused anymore somebody i feel like we have somebody here that has been observing and watching and waiting to you know, make their decision, but now they have some sort of facts. They got their facts. They got their proof, some sort of proof. And now that they have their proof, they're about to uh, step into the picture. Okay, they're about to step into the picture. Um, hmm. We do have somebody here that is making a decision. They're making a decision to, I feel like they're to come out of hiding and expose. Somebody could be getting exposed if they've been lying or being false or being fake, whatever. They're going to be exposed. There's some sort of exposure here. Um, the high priest is completely unaware. The high priest is reversed. Secrets are about, something is about to be revealed. It is. And there's going to be some consequences. There's go there is consequences here. And I feel like the law is going to get involved. So I don't know who this is for, but there's some sort of consequences. Um, I, somebody may have been engaging in some extremely unhealthy behavior. Extremely unhealthy. You know, it almost feels like somebody is going to jail. I'm sorry. I don't I don't want to scare anybody. I don't know if you know somebody that is. But somebody could be going to jail for li whatever they're doing. Um, there's definitely some sort of falseness here. And things, this, and things are going to get shown, okay? It's going to get shown. These lies are going to get shown and there's going to be some consequences, okay? Um... 
legalities. There is definitely going to be some legalities here. There is some legalities. Somebody's about to make a decision. And I think that um, this may even have to do with a business partnership, you know, with... Uh, because this is a professional, and this could be a business partnership. So it's like, hmm, it's like there could be a business partner that partnership that is going south, or somebody reveals something that is shady that is going on. Um, oh, we have the Empress here. Now we could have this man that is making a decision to uh, communicate with an Empress. Okay, because this is taking action after blocking it now this is blocking this guy's got the sort of communication he hasn't been communicating he's been watching he has he has been watching he's now he's finding the confidence i think it looks like he's going and if this is your story this portion this part and i don't know if this is all somebody that works in protective services or somebody that works in security or somebody that is a police officer this person is a professional of some sort very perfect. Could be a business owner. Could own a big business. Who This person is in a position of authority. Okay? He is. So he has the power in his hands. He is going to be making a decision. He has not done anything yet. We have the Empress. The Empress is beautiful. She is tender, loving care. It's harvest time. She is glowing she's beautiful she has multiple options she does have multiple options she goes oh look at that shit she's barefoot that's funny <laughs> ten of swords reversed So we have somebody here that is overwhelmed. They are overwhelmed. They're carrying something. They're carrying a heavy burden. I wonder if this is somebody from the past. Yeah, I, you know, I don't know if this is somebody from the past, but it could be somebody from the past. Because this is this could be somebody coming back from the dead. Something coming back from the dead. But this is also you made your bed in. Now you can lie, now you need to lie in it. So we have somebody here that is overwhelmed with pain. It looks like pain. Somebody is suffering. It feels like we have somebody here that is suffering. They are in some sort of pain. They may be even having some chronic health problems. It feels like there is some health problems here. And I think that, that these health problems are being caused from karma. It's like karma is serving all these problems because of previous actions. And I think it's affecting health. This person is tired, tired, exhausted, exhausted, overwhelmed, trying to do too much, trying to prove. We have somebody here that is trying to prove somebody to be somebody that they are not. And that is not the right thing to do. So I feel like we, somebody may collapse even. Okay. Somebody may collapse. They may, um, end up going to the hospital. They try to do too much or something like that. Oh, some, but there's some poor health here. There is definitely some poor health here. We have somebody's health is declining. And it's declining pretty fast. Okay. Again, collapse up here as well. So somebody may collapse and their health is, maybe they're overdoing it. They're, they are overdoing it. Maybe they're doing it, overdoing it with drugs or alcohol or something or with work or with everything combined. Okay. Um... We have somebody here that is re going to be getting some sort of karma. They don't respect others. 
this person over here, whoever this person is, that is going to experience this collapse, whatever it is, this upheaval, this downfall, this person has made some poor choices. They have uh, been very controlling. They have been pretending. They have been fake. We have somebody here that is fucking fake. And this person that is fake is going to receive some sort of karma for being fake, okay? Um... What is going to happen to this person? This one's sitting pretty. She is sitting pretty. Something is headed towards this person. Somebody has made a decision that they want this one. The person hasn't communicated yet, though. And perhaps that's this person's karma. star we have a star here star this is help beauty somebody is hoping they are hoping they are hoping They're hoping to come back. They're hoping to to come back or something like that. They're hoping for a chance. They're hoping. They're hoping. Three of Wands reversed. I mean upright. I'm sorry. Get prepared. There's going to be an arrival. Get prepared to hear a message. Get, get prepared. Something is about. It's right there. It's coming. It's coming. Something is coming. And it, whatever it is, it's exactly what you deserve. Put it that way. Okay? It could be something good. It could be something bad. Some whatever, whatever it is that you deserve, it is coming. Okay? It is coming. We have somebody here that has been very controlling, though. They have been controlling. And they have been lying. Okay? I know they have been. But we do have some prayers that are being answered as well. Somebody's prayers are being answered. Get prepared to have your prayers answered for somebody. Could be dealing with a Libra. We have something to do with a Libra here. We have Taurus as well. Aquarius. Get prepared for karma. Okay, get prepared whether it's good or bad. I'm telling you what. Get prepared for get prepared for some karma. Get prepared for justice to be served. Okay? I mean that's what that is. You can't get away with it. Somebody it's like you can't get away with being false. You can't get away with being being a liar. You can't. You can't. So anyway, I feel as though we have somebody that is, you know, doing quite well. That is about to, whoever this person, this, this is like the Empress in the Minor Arcana. We do have somebody that is probably going to get scooped up. This person is going to, there's going to be an entrance. This person is entering this person is entering. Um, this person is just sitting pretty, glowing, on top of the world, right? On top of the world. So, um, we do have somebody here that lacks confidence. We have somebody here that lacks confidence, and maybe it's the person that is suffering, that is suffering, that is overwhelmed, maybe fearful. This person may lack confidence to approach Okay, somebody may lack some confidence to approach or to even to apologize. This could be an apology. So it's like there could be an apology. Somebody may be apologizing. You know, narcissists don't apologize, but other people do. So um, I think we have somebody here that is hoping. They are hoping for the best. They are hoping that 
uh, by speaking up and telling the truth and going after what they want that they will be given a chance so I feel like there is going to be a communication that comes through for this very self-sufficient person I mean the Empress and the Nine of Pentacles is a worthy individual this person is very worthy very valuable very hard-working very self-sufficient doesn't need anybody but has multiple options doesn't chase this person doesn't chase doesn't chase any man so this person this this king right here has been thinking about it has been thinking about this one so i know the story changed but we do have uh somebody that is about to get exactly what they deserve wait for it it's coming <laughs> in the next couple of days I'd say within the next three days somebody may be getting a, a payout of some sort it may even be an inheritance or something or a bonus or a new job or something like that something that pays more um, or they may be getting a, are coming together with somebody that can take really good care of them. I mean, this person is very abundant, beautiful, uh, self-sufficient, uh, comfortable. So, somebody is about to uh, get the justice that they deserve, that they've been praying for. Somebody's prayers are about to be answered. Um, and maybe if you were praying, and I know that I don't, I don't like to say this, but if you were wondering if the person that uh, just about killed you was going to get their karma, this is just this is a near-death experience, is going to get their karma. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Okay? This is a horrendous loss. It is. And that loss could be you. So, and it could be male or female or whatever. Somebody is, this is getting, you getting what you deserve, okay? So yes, there is children in the background, so I don't need to, you know, I know I'm, somebody's going to say, I'm sure I hear children in the background. Yes, you do hear children in the background, you are correct. So anyway, um, get prepared for some sort of, uh, get prepared for some sort of karma good or bad this has to do with uh it's a blessing of some sort uh, this is gonna this is going to help you to heal it is uh help you to heal from this painful experience very painful i also feel like the law is is going to get involved with whoever is the one that uh, was fake Okay, whoever was fake, whoever was pretending, whoever was lying, you know, that it feels like it's the law, whether it's the universal law or the earthly law, it's like the law or it's the health, their health is, de somebody's health is declining and it is declining fast. So anyway, that's all I got. Good luck.